hope you guys are having a good day. So I want to get on here to show you a recipe that I'm making with the grill and griddle. It's called a uh, grilled cheese or pizza grilled cheese, I think. Um, it is really good. It's, I've made it before, one of my favorites. And the best thing about it is it, it tastes good. It, um, and it's fast and easy to make. So in my bowl here, I have some raw chicken tenders. And then I'm gonna just measure out. You just squeeze this here, if you can see, and it has a one tablespoon and a two tablespoon measure. So I'm just gonna measure out the two tablespoons of oil here. And, um, I don't have my glasses on so I can't see. And while I'm doing that, the griddle over here is heating up, which I need to open because it is going to smoke. Hold on. All right, there we go, let that open up. So I'm gonna pour the oil in here. And then I have our everything but the pizza seasoning. And it's about one and a tablespoons of everything but the seasoning, or everything but the pizza, sorry. And I'm gonna take this off here. Have to add some time on there so that's preheated so I'll put some of that in there and then we're gonna mix this chicken up a little bit and put it on the grill and while that's cooking on the grill we'll make the butter for the bread okay so mix this up a little bit a little bit more seasoning I love this everything there's a pizza dip that you can make with this everything but the sea I keep saying everything but the seasoning everything but the people pizza seasoning that's a tongue twister there that's really good it's like a pizza dip you know mozzarella cheese all that good stuff uh, pepperoni which I don't eat pepperoni but I put the pepperoni in there because a lot of almost everybody likes it right all right so and then you just dip it with like some nice Italian bread Fresh Italian bread is so good. So I'm gonna grill up this chicken on the grill here. Best thing about this grill is you can cook both sides at once. Nice and quick. Put this in the sink. And while this cooks up, I'm gonna grab the butter here. So I have a half a stick of butter and I already put two cloves of garlic, but I will save one so I can show you. So I'm gonna take this clove of garlic. Best thing about our garlic press is you don't have to peel the garlic. You just stick it in there like that and press. And then there's a tool that you can use and it has a flat side and you just scrape off the garlic. It also has a brush, so when you're ready to clean it, see the skin stays in there, you just put the brush in there like that and it pops out the skin right in your garbage can. So while the chicken's cooking and I mix this up, then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some Italian bread and um, let me turn this temperature down a little bit. I think I had the temperature up a little bit too high. Then I'll take some Italian bread and it's just gonna be like grilled cheese. You uh, butter both sides of the bread and you um, some mozzarella cheese on it. And you put, you're gonna, we're gonna cut this chicken up into thirds when we're done. You put the chicken on there, press it down like a panini and you have your grilled cheese. So, so good. So, um, let this cook up a little bit and I'll be back. Okay, so I took the chicken off the grill and um, cut it, some of them up. You can see that, so the chicken looks really good here. Um, here's a little one here, I'm not gonna cut the little one up, but that's kind of what it looks like. Now what I'm gonna do is, I'm just, I like to use the, our tongs here. And I'm going to take the paper towel and just clean the grill a little bit. Get off some of that crust. I don't mind some of it left on here. Um, you know, kind of flavor, right? It's just some flavor. So after 
after I do this, I already have the bread buttered up. pizza grilled cheese. What do you guys think? Think that sounds good? So I have the bread here, the garlic butter on the bread. I'm going to put it here. I'm going to put two pieces of mozzarella cheese because you um, can never have enough cheese, right? Two pieces of the mozzarella cheese. And I will take some chicken and put the chicken on here. And then I will take the top of the, it's already, it, this is also buttered, and push down on it. And um, I accidentally turned this off, so it's going to take a minute. So I'm going to let this heat up again because I accidentally turned it off. And then I will come back and show you what the grilled cheese looks like. Okay. Okay, so I'm back. So here is our grilled cheese. I cut it in half. That's what it looks like. And then you have your, I don't know if I could spread it apart, but there's the chicken and the mozzarella in there. And it is so good. Um, I like to dip mine in marinara sauce because I just love red sauce. Some people like to dip it in ranch. So um, this is a recipe I think you guys have got to try, especially if you're a pizza lover, chicken lover, something like that. My question to you is, when you make it, will you dip it in ranch or marinara or both? Who knows? I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. And um, my grandson's trying to get in. So there's my cue to bye. Say bye. Bye.